what's up guys welcome back to my channel so today's video i am going to do a makeup look for you so i'm going to try to upload a lot more videos for you guys i know i've been gone for uh, a little while but life has been lifing so <laughs> i'm sure everybody knows how that goes but shit has been pretty crazy for everybody um so I hope you guys understand why I have been gone for a while, but I am back and I'm going to start posting more videos for you guys. Fun videos, guys. Fun videos, makeup, hair, whatever I feel like doing. This is my channel now, so that's what I'm going to start doing for you guys. Today is Thursday, October 21st. I am um, recording this video now, but when you guys do see this video, it's going to be Saturday. Just to let you guys know, I was actually creating this look and this outfit for saturday because uh the hubby and i are going out on a date so i just wanted to record this video for you guys today because on saturday i will not have time to uh record for you guys a full makeup video like this so i just wanted to show you guys for today but here we are guys definitely enjoy this video today this makeup look um also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also click that notification bell so you guys don't miss any more videos stay tuned <clears throat> oh excuse me all right y'all so i am going to i just finished curling my hair i might have to touch it up a little bit but i am going to do my face now so this is going to be a get ready with me video and i don't know what look i'm going for um my outfit is basically like white and black <laughs> don't laugh at me guys i know i'm always wearing black but i just can't help it i love those colors anyways so i'm thinking of maybe maybe a neutral look or maybe something with like silver black and silver i don't know we'll figure it out but i got my stuff here ready and i am ready to go i'm recording this video now but um, when it does come out, it's going to be on the 23rd, which is going to be Saturday, which is our date night. But I just wanted to do this look tonight for y'all. All right, so I'm going to prime my face with the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Primer. I'm just going to dab a little bit in this area and this area because my T-zone because... I am the oiliest in this area. And my face is breaking out a little bit. Something that hasn't happened in a while. So that means probably Aunt Flo is coming pretty soon. Okay, so today I actually went to the store and picked up two foundations. Um, I've never used these, or I should say I haven't picked up these shades before. I was actually doing, or uh, using different shades. So I have the Maybelline Fit Me found Matte Poreless Foundation in the shade 340 Cappuccino. But then I also picked up the L'Oreal True Match Foundation. And this shade is uh, the W8. And what is that? I think it's Warm Cream Cafe, W8. So we'll see which one is actually my match. Only put a little bit on my hand. I almost made a huge mess. So I just wanna see which one. I don't know if you guys can see that on camera. Maybe I should add a little more. Mm. So now I'm going to try the Fit Me Foundation. And I flipped my brush on this side. So first foundation's on this side. I'm flipping it on this side.
To be honest, I might mix both shades together. I think I'm gonna mix both shades together. I was recording when I was putting this on, but I wasn't. But this is the shade. It looks a little light on camera because of the lighting. But as I'm looking here, I mean, we're going to put some warmth in my face, but first I'm going to, I'm going to conceal my under eyes and I'm using uh, the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. And I only use a little bit. going to brighten it up a little bit more with the Maybelline I don't remember what this concealer is called but <laughs> it's a Maybelline concealer okay going to set the concealer with my Maybelline press powder or loose powder sorry shine free in the shade medium this is one of my favorites to use well it's actually my favorite to use right now Using this to brush off the excess powder. I like to also set my under eye because um, I have allergies and my eye, my right eye tends to tear up and it ruins my makeup and I don't have time to sit there and keep fixing it. But when I set it with this, the Maybelline Fit Me powder, let's see. Okay, so this is the matte poreless pressed powder in the shade 330 Toffee Caramel. And you see my allergies are already starting up. So I'm just dabbing it a little bit in there. Slam that off. And definitely just press it in it is time to warm my face up because it does look a little ashy looking well not ashy I just do look really like ghostly looking so all right so I'm gonna go in with my true complexion contour palette so I'm gonna go in with the contour shade right here I'm 
and you want to move it into i like when i'm contouring oh, we're still holding it so when i contour i like to um sweep my brush warm my face up and this brush is from um <laughs> this is an old school brush from vanity planet it's very very old but this is my favorite contour brush i use this all the time when i'm contouring So now it is time for my brows. I don't like to really do my brows on camera, so I'm going to do it off camera because I have to concentrate very well when I'm doing my brows because they do take me the longest. Usually I do it first before I even apply foundation or anything, but today I just wanted to do it a little bit different just to see um, basically how it is when I'm doing my brows with all of this on my face. So I will come back when I'm done. All right, y'all, so my brows are done I don't know what do y'all think I'm kind of feeling like they're they're cousins right now and not really sisters I don't know but they look good to me so anyways um, I went ahead and primed my eyes so I'm going to jump into the eyeshadow now go in with this palette here I actually got this palette from Amazon and I thought it was a really pretty palette it's called impressed you by beauty glazed and then here are the colors. Very pretty, pretty, pretty matte colors. There's a little shimmer shades in there. A few of them are shimmer shades. So as my transition shade, I'm going to go in with this one here. Okay, so my battery is dying. <laughs> I'm going to put another battery in and then I'll be back. All right, y'all. So I put in the other battery. These things, they're starting to die a little fast. I gotta actually get one of the ones that I could just leave on a charger. So I don't have to keep getting up and charging batteries. And so when I was um, actually um, putting the shade in my crease, I was using this uh, BH Cosmetics 6 brush, the same one that I basically used to contour my nose. I just um, cleaned it off with uh, alcohol. Use this again because I actually love to use this brush, but I'm gonna use the same brush and go in. I'm gonna go in with this brown shade right here.
I'm gonna go in with uh, my Aaliyah palette eyeshadow palette it's called age ain't nothing this came out about I want to say this came out in 2019 or maybe 2020 can't remember when this really came out but uh, the colors in here are really really pretty and then I'm gonna go in with this silver shade right here silvery shimmery shade right there So now I'm going to go ahead and line my eyes with my e.l.f. liquid liner. I don't do wings. I'm not good with doing wings. So it's just going to be a black line. And probably a small little, little swoop right here. Okay, so next I'm going to go in with my Maybelline The Falsh's Last Lash Lift Mascara. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna run and go get my lash glue. Um, I do not have it up here. I will be right back. I'm back. I'm going to put on my lashes. Um, this is from my lash line, Beauty by Stace, and I actually had to relaunch. So this is the style, I hope you guys can see it. Really pretty. I'm gonna line my lips with the NYX matte lip liner. And this, what shade is this? Uh, Club Hopper. It looks brown, like a dark brown, but it really is not a dark brown. It's more like a maroonish color. shade here it's a mm, it's called reach you I don't know if you can see reach you I got this uh, off of, on Amazon also but came with a lot of nude shades and this is a matte um, lip gloss and this is the shade silk indulgent number one so this is a nude as you can see I'm going to place that in the middle of my lips. Okay, 
so now I'm going to add some lip gloss. I'm not sure which one I want to put. Mm, okay, so actually I'm going to top it off with my Milani lip gloss here. And this is in the shade Soft Rose. I almost forgot to highlight, so... I'm going to set my face with my Urban Decay All Nighter Spray. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and get dressed and show you guys my final look. I'll be right back. Alright y'all, so this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed um, watching me do this look. It's been a long time since I've actually recorded for you guys a makeup look and actually talk in my video. <laughs> this is something that I never really, really do. Only because my background noise is, it's always noisy. So I was actually going to pair my outfit with gold um, jewelry, but then I was like, wait a minute, that doesn't really go together with black and white. So I paired it with this watch um, and these earrings. This necklace, I never really take it off. It's a gold necklace, but my husband got me this for Valentine's Day a couple years ago. So I still thought it was pretty cute with this. And then these earrings right here. I don't even remember where I got these from. These are pretty old. But um, this is probably like the only pair of silver earrings that I have, maybe. So this is my final look. I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, stay safe, stay beautiful, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.